Dr. K. P. Ramalingam. Sir. Thank you, Vice Chairman, sir. I rise to support the bill. I support the bill because Honorable Finance Minister certainly would have given a considerable thought and also applied his wisdom before finalizing the draft of the bill, sir. I also hope and believe that our FM would have given a deep thought to, to the fact what could be the effect and the implication it will have if a statutory authority like CB is given with the powers that vested with the judicial power. Certainly, ministers' experience and wisdom would have prevailed upon him, sir. Under this assumption, I support the bill. Statement of objects and reason of the bill as well they treat the cause and the background under which the bill is moved. I am convinced with all the, those reasons enumerated and also after the finance minister's introductory ex explanation, I am fully satisfied, sir. Sir, amendment to section 11 of the principal act empowers CB to call for information and records from any person including any bank or any other authority or board or corporation established or constituted by under any central or state act, which in the opinion of the board shall be relevant to any investigation or inquiry by the board in respect of any transaction in securities. Sir, while functioning so, it should be ensured that CB do not transgress its power. I expect an affirmative reply from the minister in this regard during his rec reply, sir. Sir, amendment proposed section 15 A, B, C, D, E, F, and G and H and 15 HA, 15 HB pertains to quantum of amount. I welcome all those provisions. But, sir, now I come to the new introduction of new sections. 26A, 26B, 26C, 26D, and 26E. These sections deal with the establishment of special court. Establishment of special courts with the sole purpose of providing speedy relief to the affected investors is good initiative, sir. But take care that the investors are not subjected to undergo legal tangle in getting back their hard-earned money. What is the point in securing the set after horses has run away, sir? Various scams and schemes with the tall and high claims cheated the common man all over the nation. Starting from Kalaimakal Sabha scam 15 years before in Tamil Nadu. Teakwood scheme, that is Tekumaram growing scheme. Ramesh Kar scheme. Sitfans fraud in Tamil Nadu, Sahara case, Punji scheme, Emu farming scheme, and then last but not least, Sar, Sarada Sitfans scheme. In Odisha and West Bengal, they looted the poor man's money. There are many instances of common man being cheated regularly in the systematic manner. There is no end to this. The hard earned money of the common man is cheated by a few, and law is blind in this regard so far. At least by now, we woke up from this bill. Made a new beginning, I hope this initiative will go a long way in preventing the common man from being cheated. And also I request the minister in this bill has to provide a special provision while the public sector shares will show the trade, the central trade union also to be consulted, sir. This is my request. With these words, I welcome the bill, sir, wholeheartedly. Thank you, sir. Thank you.